Hey there you guys, so it's been a few days, uh, basically a few days late since my last video, but I did want to kind of give you the update now because it's going to be a little while before I start doing videos again. So, unfortunately, um, I am going to be taking my break from videos basically after this week, which I'm not too happy about. And my snakes are going to new homes for the time being. Um, I already got rid of Granola and Onyx. They are currently with my one friend. Um, so Volibee and Bell Awesome are actually about to go to another friend for a little while. I don't really want to say goodbye to these girls but um I don't really have a choice right now unfortunately I am getting ready to move soon I'm getting ready to have a baby so unfortunately my babies here have to come later but I'm not getting rid of them permanently I do promise you guys that but it will be a while before you see them Again, I know this is like a week late post kind of, but I'd rather do it now before anything else. So, um, I did want to give you the update as well. Uh, basically, before I gave Granola and Onyx to my friend, uh, they both had their shed. I believe Onyx is going back into shed. Um, Volibee is looking very weird right now um trying to put the oh it's okay you fall um so volaby is looking a little weird i don't know if you can see it that well um so it looks like there's a little gloss over her eye almost like a cat but at the same time uh hold on it's like really hard to see. I'm very sorry about it. But um, yeah, she has like a little cloudy patch and I feel like it's an eye cap. But I'm not absolutely sure what's going on with her. Um, on top of that, she has, it looks like dried blood on the bottom of her mouth. Which I don't know if, uh, I'm hoping that. It's from when she ate the rat the other day, but at the same time, I'm going to give them both the soak today. It does appear to me, although she has no cap on her eye yet. Oh, no, sweets. You're not, you're not doing this. Um, I have to be very careful with, uh, Volaby. She is a pistol when it comes down to it. She is trying so hard to get away right now. Um, she doesn't really like being handled too much. So I am trying to adjust her to all of this. Um, but, uh, she does have this eye cap on the one side of her face. And she does have what appears to be dry blood on the bottom. And I'm praying that it's not a sign of mouth rot. But it... I don't even know at this point, like, I'm just, I'm done, honestly, with this. She's, uh, not really growing the way that I want her to at this point. Um, now she is eating weekly at this point, but I feel like nothing is really fattening her up, even though I do feed her as often as I should, um... Belle, on the other hand, she is very fat and very calm. Um, she also looks like she's about to go into shed very soon, so I'm actually really happy about that. Um, Volaby did just come out of shed. She had a small, messy shed, but everything came out perfect. Now she has an eye cap. Now she has some... I don't know what's on her face right now, but yeah, so that's an issue for me. I'm not really happy with that small issue. Don't know what exactly is going on here. It, it, 
I don't know, honestly. Um, it's kind of a puzzle to me. Um, unfortunately, like I said, I did already get rid of uh, granola and onyx, so I can't show you guys them today. Uh, but they are doing very well. I finally got granola officially uh, sexed. Because I never did before. Um, so Granola is 100% female. Onyx is 100% male. And these two girls are also 100% female. So three girls and one boy. I am about to start collecting female boas as well. Um, preferably hoping to get some different morphs in there. I'm looking for... Uh, Moon glows, snow glows, uh, more anneries, because I do like these black and white looking snakes, and she did look better a few days ago. Um, so she may be getting ready to shed again. I don't even know, honestly. She's so small that it's a possibility that this is probably her getting ready again. I don't know. Um, I'm hoping that anyways. But yeah, uh, I'm definitely looking to get, uh, I want, uh, I believe it was a leopard. Um, I want some Motley's. I want, I want a collection basically, which I don't know what she's doing, but you can see now what I mean by she's really wiry. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and put these girls away because I have had them out for a few minutes already. And I don't want to disturb them too much. Mostly I don't want to disturb Volaby. Um, Belle is always usually really calm. She doesn't really do anything. She doesn't really go anywhere. But swinging her around trying to control Volaby is not my favorite task. So I'm just going to call the video quits here and I hope you guys have a lovely day. Um, I will definitely be back at videos in hopefully a month or two. I can't make any promises because I do have to start building a shed for my girls once I move. So it's going to be a work in progress, but I am going to have an actual breeding room set up. I am going to have a few boa constrictors, all four of my originals. Hopefully, I do find a nice-looking girl, larger girl. Um, I do want everybody's line to eventually be uh, coexist with Granola's line, just because she's my first snake and everything. But at this point, from what I've been told, she may not be full dwarf. Therefore, breeding her with everyone may be may not be what I need so we'll have to see what happens from there but until I actually figure out what I'm gonna do this this there we go until I figure out what I'm gonna do I don't know I'm sorry sweets she doesn't like me right now. She's not unhappy, but she's not granola. She won't let me kiss her yet. Um, nope. She's smart. <laughs> but again, I will see you guys on the next video. So I hope you guys have an amazing day. And I will see you in a few weeks. Hopefully I do have my breeding room set up already by then. I do plan on having a small shed built. And I do hopefully plan on getting more boas. But the boas are going to come after the shed and after I get my four babies back. So I will start uh, showing you guys the current stock again before I start adding stock. So yeah. Um, 
Hope you guys enjoyed seeing Volaby and Bellossom for the last time, for the time being. I know you haven't really gotten to see them that much, but they will be taken very good care of. My friend does have a reptile rescue going on, and I know they're going to be in really good hands. Um... Hopefully she figures out what's going on with Volaby, or he figures out what's going on with Volaby. I'm sorry. Um, my other friend that has granola and onyx, she's taking really good care of them right now as well. So you guys will see them as soon as they come back. And until then, hope you guys enjoy the video and I will see you next time. <laughs> Bye.